In his first game as a Richmond Spider, defensive tackle Winston Craig intercepted a pass. Pass partially deflected, and it's intercepted. It's picked off by the true freshman. Winston Craig with the interception in his first collegiate game. And he hasn't come off the field since. The bell cow of UR's defensive line the past two seasons, Craig has become one of the most productive defensive tackles in FCS football. I think this year has probably been some of the best football I've played. Uh, I think why? Because uh, freshman year, I came in, I didn't register, uh, so I didn't really have a chance to like get stronger um, and necessarily get acclimated to the speed of the game and things. Sophomore year, uh, we returned a lot of guys. Um, didn't start at the beginning of the season, and then due to injuries, I ended up starting. So had some more opportunities there. And then last year, uh, starting the whole season, um, I feel like my play got even better. And then this year, I think things are just kind of firing on all cylinders. He's having a great year. Um, and uh, it's, you know, in the run game, uh, and again, the numbers that show themselves here right now are the sacks and the and the plays in the backfield, the disruptive plays. But, you know, he's wadding up the inside and in the middle, and he's making tackles on the line of scrimmage in the run game. I think he's just really evolving as a, as a player. Always strong against the run. This season, the six foot four, two hundred and ninety five pound senior has done equal damage versus the pass. Craig leads the CAA and is ranked eighth nationally in quarterback sacks with seven. Winston and I, we sat down and we talked, uh, had a discussion about what he needs to accomplish if he wants to have aspirations to continue his football career. And uh, the number one thing is guys that go on are guys that can actually pass rush. So over the course of the summer and last spring, he really made it a conscious effort to work on his footwork and getting stronger and better use of his hands uh, as, as long as flipping his hips. So uh, he did all those intangible things that uh, needs to be done to have a great year and it's, it's coming to light for him. Craig is as durable as he is consistent. Saturday's game at Elon will be Winston's 32nd consecutive start. Last season, in the Spiders' run to the FCS National Semifinals, Craig played an astonishing 1,003 snaps. All the years that Winston's been here, he has absolutely never missed a day of training. And uh, one thing I credit that to is he absolutely loves the game of football and everything that that entails. Winston Craig, when he walks down the hall to go to meetings, uh, he, he's got a smile on his face and, and, and he's fired up about it. He's fired up about coming in the weight room. He's fired up about going to practice. So um, he, he really embraces every aspect of football. And I think that's one thing that, you know, it's, it's I guess the saying embrace the grind, which is, a, which is a saying we use here often in our program. Uh, he, he definitely 100% embraces the grind. I've been on the line since I was little. I remember my mom told me a story uh, when I first started playing at the YMCA, uh, I told her that if I didn't play quarterback, I was going to quit because uh, I had no clue. And she 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 already knew that I was going to be on the line the first day. Uh, so ever since then, I've been playing on the line, um, and I just, I just it just feels like the perfect fit for me. And I just enjoy every moment of it. It's fun, uh, and every play, even if I don't make a play, is I'm just I just have fun being out there. I have fun with my teammates. Um, so every, every play is very fun for me. Two receivers to each side, empty backfield. He pumps to the right, and he's going to be sacked by Winston Craig back at the 32-yard line. Craig. How important is it to you personally to finish strong? It's huge. Um, every year since, since I've been here, we've gotten better. Uh, freshman year, I think we finished like 5-5 five, five or 6-6 six and six or something. Didn't go to playoffs. Sophomore year, went to second round. Last year, made it to the semifinals. So... Not only do I want to win, I just, it just feels right. Um, so, you know, this is the last ride for me, so I'm just trying to make the most out of it.